It was a crime that left many in the Hegwish neighborhood shaken. That unnamed juvenile expected to be charged as an adult, police say, with first-degree murder. And word of his arrest comes on the day of the victim's funeral. Her family and some in the neighborhood knew her as Grandma Jo. A retired city worker of 25 years, Yvonne Ruzic continued working because of the people she met. So we have a 70-year-old woman who's still working extremely hard, and then her life is uh, tragically ended uh, really for no reason other than, uh, than a car. Ruzic arrived early for her store job that morning of August 16th and waited in her car for the business to open, her stepson in another vehicle there to look after her. But police say that didn't stop the two would-be carjackers. As the victim drives away, one of the offenders shoots into her car. At that point, she crashes, the offenders get back into their car, and then they actually drive up and shoot into the car uh, several more times. Police say the incident was one of several carjackings connected to the pair, and after tracking each case, it led them to arrest a 17-year-old Chicago boy. Another suspect still being sought. Police declining to say which of these two pictured is the one in custody, but still unanswered why they targeted Ruzic, who barely had time to react. There wasn't a lot of interaction there, uh, but that just shows, I don't know how emboldened they were and how quick they were to discharge a firearm. Police say that second offender who's being sought is also a juvenile, and they say they do know who they're looking for. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.